Hello, I'm Nalika De Silva, reporting for Wink Ball at Pace Gallery in Mayfair. Tonight I'm here for Richard Tuttle's exhibition Critical Edge, which explores space, 3D and other elements using fabric. Let's find out if Richard Tuttle does have the edge and indeed, can he make me a new jacket? With Richard's work, there are no hard and fast answers to the composition, the colour layout, why this is next to that. There's a general feeling of poetry, of fragility, and he's kind of giving you the tools to heighten your cultural vision. I've always loved uh, Richard Toto's work. Um, I first encountered it what, maybe 20 years ago in an exhibition in a big museum in Spain. And I love uh, the way he deals with fragile materials and with the surface and very, I don't know, very simple elements becoming something magical. So that's, that's why I like it. Yeah. The thing I like about it the most is the kind of process, the fact that he's hand-stitched it. There's obviously quite like a meditative thing that's gone on here, so yeah. Each exhibit is in a series of four and I'm trying to understand the, the connections between each of the, the discrete uh, parts. So obviously there's uh, something, something that, that is underneath that uh, in, in a uh, pop art kind of way. I'm still trying to understand and uh, it's interesting for sure. These are particularly different to other stuff. Reminded me of jeans and uh, the colour and uh, the way he left uh, unfinished, like uh, jacked edges and uh, unsewn bit, yeah, edgy, yeah. Well, we've come to the end of our tour at the Pace Gallery today, and it does appear many people think Richard Tuttle does have the critical edge, but unfortunately his friend and associate says he won't make me a new jacket. Richard Tuttle, please, please make me a new jacket. I've been Alec De Silva reporting for Winkball.